A rotation is a transformation in which the object is rotated about a fixed point. The hands of an analog clock rotate around the face. The moon rotates around the earth. The earth and all its planets rotate around the sun. When you are driving in a roundabout, that is a kind of rotation. The direction of rotation can either be clockwise, that is the direction a clock moves, or counterclockwise. Although the angle of rotation can be of any size, we will limit the angles to 90 degrees, one quarter turn, 180 degrees, half turn, and 270 degrees, three quarter turn. To do a rotation, you will need a center of rotation and a direction angle. The fixed point from which the rotation takes place is called the center of rotation. In this example, the center of rotation is 079. The amount of rotation made is called the angle of rotation. The angle of rotation in this example is 90 degrees counterclockwise. Start by joining the point A and point O. Since the angle of rotation is 90 degrees counterclockwise, construct this angle at point O. Use a protractor to measure the angle. Measure the distance of AO along the new line. You can use a ruler or a compass if you have one. Mark the point A prime. This is a 90 degree counterclockwise rotation of point A around the fixed point O. This example will show a rotation of 180 degrees counterclockwise around point O. Again, start by joining point A and O. Since the angle of rotation is 180 degrees counterclockwise, construct this angle at point O. You can use a protractor to measure the angle, or a ruler in this case. Measure the distance of AO along the new line and mark A prime. Notice you will get the same point if the rotation was 180 degrees in the clockwise direction. Now for the last example. Show a rotation of 270 degrees counterclockwise around point O. Again, start by joining point A and point O. Since the angle of rotation is 270 degrees counterclockwise, construct this angle at point O. Use a protractor to measure the angle. Measure the distance of AO along the new line and mark A prime. Notice that you would get the same point if the rotation was 90 degrees in the clockwise direction.